Now's my chance. Quietly. Okay. Now which one is... That's not cement, is it? I don't think so. Okay, now. Quietly. Quietly. Alright. There it is. Okay. Uh, let's see what we can find in here. Is that open for quick escape? Um... Where is her letter? Not that one. Where is it? Where did... Where did I put that? This is what I get for stuffing things into my pack without realizing where I've put them. There it is. Okay. Now... This is his journal, I believe. Um, it's frost fallen. Some orc mercenaries have come through the city looking for work. One of them is a brute of a man, the other rather charming orcish dame. Even if only because of her good looks, I've given them a job. Curious to see how things will go. Drazar has always been one for surprises. Huh. Charming orcish dame, huh? Right then. Okay. Well. Going to leave that here. I do believe it will look suspicious if that disappears. Okay. Good. Didn't realize I was in there. Right, and I think I will be out of here. No guards. Good. Whew. Is that done? All right. Um. Yes, because Arius does still owe me a favor. Well, more or less, he will. As soon as I find those Arca. Akaviri artifacts. Yes, that. Now, that orc is probably asleep by now. Oh, I've gotten myself turned around yet again, haven't I? Well done. Okay, so. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. You what? Let's see here. Looks like that's it. Got to go. If this is another letter from some Jarl in Skyrim, I'm... I'm going to be very confused is what I'm going to do. What did he just hand me? Oh. Harvest Send Flyer. 27th of last seed. The year has turned its circle. The seasons have come and go. The harvest is all gathered in chilly north winds below. Taverns will be busy throughout the day, but free food and drinks will be available for all outside after 5 p.m. All right, then. It's the 24th of last seed. That's, um... Okay. Right. Oh, that's, uh... That's not where I'm going. I might as well turn in for the night, get a few hours rest. I know how Adios feels about sleepless nights. Oh. Well. 
Well, you're still awake. Be more careful. Sorry. Wine, mead, ale, water. What will it be? Um, same room as before, perhaps? Ah, you did well to choose the Gerald View. Your room rental also includes complimentary access to the Gerald View bathhouse on the lower floor. Peruse it at your leisure. Our customers find it very rejuvenating. Allow me to show you to your room. Right this way. Right. Obviously he doesn't, uh... He doesn't realize he's seen me before. Oh well. It's early in the morning. I don't really... You alright there, Stantis? You're, uh... A little bit of sleep on your feet, aren't you? Yes, well... Be more careful. Me too. I'm, I'm, I'm trying. Can I help you? No. Goodbye. Ooh, this is what I get for staying up in the middle of the night, doing if you espionage need anything else, and whatnot. Just call me. Will do. Or at the moment, I just need sleep and to take this backpack off for a few minutes, a few hours. Oh, whatever. Busy day. Busy day ahead of me. Where's my backpack? Where'd I put it? Right by the door. Oh. There's the hunter. Welcome to the Gerald View. What yes, can I good get morning. You? Okay. Stantis is rather a curiosity. I get a bite to eat while I'm down here. If you want food or drink, I can show you our menu. Printed on only the finest parchment, for your hands and your satisfaction. Yeah, no, I'm all right today. Ralgar Silverplow. Oh, hello. Retired hunter and tracker at your service. Your, uh, your Frelki. Frelki? Was that her name? Frelki's husband? Hello? Your, See yeah. you around. Okay. Time to go find that orc. Hello? Presumably he Presumably he's awake by now. Excuse me. Um Hmm. That man usually hangs out in front of the uh, restful the restful watchman. <laughs> he really does need to work on his pitch. Okay. Where is he? No, nope, that's the, the Argonian. Approaches. There he is. What? You're back. Any news on my wife? Who's the spineless wretch that sold us out? Tell me now. Well, I'm thinking it was Simon Gautier. He has a rather interesting journal about um, hiring people. Gautier, the Breton? Then I'll rip his. Wait, a Breton? Really, a Breton? Weak-willed, soft-spoken, magic-practicing ponces? Yep. How could a Breton overcome an orc, even with bandits on his side? I remember overhearing talk in the castle that Simon had a luxury manor up in the east of the Gerald somewhere. Go search this guy's home. See if it actually was him. Find something, anything, that conclusively links him to the crime and bring it to me. If it is the damned Breton, that's when we act. Alright, will do. Magic practicing ponces, eh? Good morning. Good morning. Well. Now I remember passing a manor on my way out east. When I was... Hello. When I was doing the, uh... I got running out to find heirlooms for Alamu that ended up not being there to begin with. Um, right. 
I forgot about potions. I require some if I'm going to be going out and uh, and dealing the with- The cold nips up here in the mountains, but I've always loved how refreshing it is. Yeah, it, it, very yes, nippy indeed. What do you need? Uh, I need to talk to this fine woman here, I actually. I take pride in my potions. As well you should. May I see what you have for sale? Nordic take a look. Tunics Alright. Aloe vera leaves. Interesting. Um... Beer? I, I mean, I suppose. I have to resist cold, draft of the night. Uh, let's see, let's see. Do you have anything about for for healing? Um, or magicka? You do. Let's see. Hmm, anything better? No, not really. I will take a few of those off your hands, actually. And, um... Do I really need that? No, not really. See you. See you. Uh, thank you for your wares, madam. That should help a great deal. One of these days I'll get better armor than this thing. <sighs> as much as I dislike carting around heavy armor everywhere, it does rather get in the way of of properly the casting spells. Extends across the entire empire. Hello. Luma is no exception. I know it's not, but we're not defying your precious concordat, are we? Leave him alone. Worship here. Perhaps not. But something must be done about that little Martin worshipping cult in the chapel. The chapel of Saint Martin. There's no Talos worship going on in there. No, but there is still man worship taking place. Martin was a man, not a god. The spirit of the Concordat... There you go again with that spirit of the Concordant nonsense. As guard captain of Bruma, I have the authority here, not you. He looks so I much will like him. I with the Thalmor as much as is necessary. But I am not going to go arrest innocence if the Concordant doesn't explicitly force me to. Yes, I urge you to. Enough, Armian. Go back to your business. The Chapel of St. Martin is under the protection of the Bruma Guard until you show me what part of your precious concordat they're violating. Now, good day. Oh, and do mind the cobblestones. They're slippery this time of year. Every time. Of year. <laughs> Don't break your neck now. Well done. Well spoken, Adius Vinius. Every time I see Armion, see, I thought Armion was the one with the with the ponytail, but I was wrong. And every time I see Armion, I I get this little flutter in my chest, like, no, no, that's not him. That's not him. Knowing him, he's still off studying whatever it is that Thalmor. Off in the Somerset Isles somewhere. Perhaps traipsing about in High Rock. I don't know. Are High Rock under Thalmor control? No. Maybe. Where am I going? Oh, yes! So. That tip about the bandits and the Akaviri artifacts. Heirlooms, whatever they were. Should be around here somewhere. You think any of those dragons from Skyrim will find their way over here? You what Dragons? Um Right. I did not know that there were dragons in Skyrim. I do believe I do believe he might be out of his mind, actually. I've not heard about any dragons. This looks promising. Alright, let's see what's in here. Okay. There's a 
there's a mushroom farm. What would bandits need with mushrooms? somebody. I heard somebody stand up. I hear... Who made that noise? Oh. There we go. I did. Hello. Come here. Oh. Ah! Damn it! All right. Oh, come on. We're going to have to do this the hard way. <laughs> Ow, damn it. He shot my hand. All right. We're doing this the hard way then. Yes, you are. Very much so. Shot my hand, you... It's fine. I'm alright. Ah, as I was saying earlier, as much as I hate Logging around this heavy armor really does... Oh, well that's interesting. It really does keep the, uh... Keep the arrows off. Damn, that hurt though. Keeps the arrows from piercing flesh, but uh, everyone take note, that stupid wannabe thief, Etienne Gouillette? Gouillette? Guilette? Something? Says he's managed to steal the carving sack of every artifact collection of all things. The idiot's probably just delusional, but either way, I want at that treasure. I'm taking some of the boys down to Bruma Caverns, where I send Guillette so he can do us the trade. The fool thinks we're going to put in a good word for him with Thorinus Cutters, but of course, to think we'd do that for him even if you wanted to. I can't believe how stupid some thieves are. He's entering the caverns the trapdoor in the old fool's house, too, which just shows how much of a damned coward he is. Either way, that's why I'm out. If you have business with me, come back in a few days once this is all dealt with. Once all this is dealt with. Well, alright then. Oh, so there's a thief lingering down in Bruma Caverns. That's, um... Great. Either the Cutters will deal with him, or... Who knows? I'll probably have to inform Adius of that when I get back. Um, should I do that first? Or should I figure out where Gautier Manor is? Gautier? Gautier? Oh, these damn Nibbanese names, I can't. <laughs> Why doesn't anybody have simple names like Arden Welk? Welk is a simple name to pronounce. Although that said, I can't really speak much of Ardenius and Perseus. Hello, Fox. All right. Let's see if we can find Adius. He does rather need to know about that, um... Hello. Can I help you? No. Oh, there's the Thelma again. Look, you already had your go at Adius. Why don't you leave him alone? Hmm. I don't believe I've seen you before. Fascinating. A newcomer to Bruma, is that what we have here? Well, not really. You're the welcoming committee, is that it? Is that what's going on here? A joker, too. Wonderful. Yet another troublemaker for us to keep an eye on. At least if your attempts at sardonicism weren't quite so... posturing. Many before you have thought themselves invincible. Above the Thalmor. Above the Dominion. Above their precious empire and its laws. Its concordats. They now find themselves hanging from trees. 
their decrepit husks wasting away amidst near-endless blizzard. Enjoy your stay in this fair city. Of course. Not many Altmer in Bruma. You might be a bit outmatched here. Next you'll be telling me, my, oh my, not many Guar in Bruma. You completely missed the point. Scales of Ori L, thanks for telling me that. I'll be sure to tell all my friends. Put up posters, even. Right. Good riddance. Good day. This is Empire-controlled space. They do realize that, right? All right, now where is that old man's house? Rosada the Resplendent invites you to his boutique of magical wonders. Don't delay. 